Today is the day. No matter what happens, Chad is getting past that bridge. Who knows what lies on the other side? Could it be salvation? Or defeat? Alrighty, boys. Welcome back to another episode of Project Zomboid. We're back with your boy Chad, and we are doing alright. We got a lot of food. Just packed with nutrients and ready for movement. And today is going to be a pretty big day. We're going to go on a bit of a, a bit of a joy ride. <laughs> you could say over towards our favorite areas. And basically what I mean by that is that it's not going to be fun. It's going to be very, very, very uh, interesting is what I'll say. Very interesting. So yeah, things are going to be fun. We're all filled up, ready to rock. I might bring a... Mm, a glove box trout. I like the sound of that because it might be an extended trip. Who knows? Put the socks in the freezer because honestly, I don't really care right now. We got ourselves a screwdriver, which is honestly pretty damn awesome. Now we can finally disassemble some stuff. But I ain't exactly done with this exploring yet, so we're going to go head out. I just want to make sure that everything is as it should be. It's looking pretty good. We got a lot of capacity in the trunk, so I'm not too worried about that. Let's uh, decide to head out. We got some digital watches. We got some just random oddities that we have. Okay, enough uh, bull crapping. It's about time we get on the open road, ladies and gentlemen. Trout in hand. <laughs> this bad boy's going straight in the glove box, is what I would say. I'll have to move this flashlight, which is fine. Air oh, wow, we can only hold three in here, huh? Hmm. You think we should cook it before we leave? That's probably a good idea. Let's go do that real quick. There we go. Now it's fully cooked, ready to rock. We'll drop it in the trunk. Yeah, with the rest of the stuff in here. And let's go fill up our water bottles. We do need that pretty badly. I'm very excited. I don't know if we'll actually make it to the castle, but I would like to drive just as far as possible, just to see where it takes us. Okay. I, I, I just want to go with the wind once in a while, you know? It's very fun to do that. So let's go fill up our bottles. Make sure we're all ready for the big hike ahead. I guess it's less of a hike and more of a drive, but hey, you know how it is sometimes. There we go. Alrighty, let's get going. The road is my oyster, and I shall be guided by the light of this new path that I found, which honestly makes things pretty nice. I just <laughs> need to not crash and die horribly. And before we leave fully, I actually want to drop a quick little worm here, just so we remember where it's at. There we go. Uh, I should probably have it a little bit closer to the outside, so we'll drop another one. Two worms ain't too bad. We can always pick them up later if, you know, things get a little bit dicey. But man, does this vehicle increase our, just, our sustainability. It increases our efficiency, our speed to do things. It does so much for me, and I am so glad to have this bad boy around. Like, look at us zooming. Now, I think I got everything down to a T of where it goes. If, as long as we follow this southern road, we should hit it very soon. Remember... This thing doesn't have good braking. <laughs> That's always a problem that we will have to deal with in the future. There's also a pretty big zombie horde around. I don't know how we're exactly going to deal with that. Try and take it slow. Try and take it below down over here, to be honest. I don't want to attract too many zombies, even though they probably are already, like, zoning in my location, right? Did, did I have speed demon? I think that's a problem here. Speed de Yeah, I do. Yeah, that'll do it. Ha <laughs> ha. Yep, here comes. Yep, here comes a tide. Okay, well, there goes that plan. I could maybe stab him through the window. No, I can't. Oh my God. Oh my Lord. All right, yeah. Any semblance of stealth I had beforehand is right out the window. Oh my God. We might just have to live out in the woods for the rest of our lives, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> Man, that is... Okay, this is actually getting a little bit dicey. This is getting very dicey. Oh, please tell me I can drive. Okay, I can... Just... Oh my god, I might actually die here. No, we're good. We can drive. We can drive. Whoo! Okay. Yeah, see you later, idiots! Oh my god! I'm screwed. I am boned. Why did I decide to head out? <laughs> Hey, we made it to somewhere. That's pretty cool. We might have to take out the trash very soon. That's fine. <gasps> Look at all those traps, dude. Oh my, we need this. 
Okay, I like this spot a lot. It's a nice scenic barn. We're gonna have to use our trunk to do this. So come on. I implore you, zombies. I implore you. Come right over. The water's fine. Okay, I think they're not. I'm gonna stay in here for like a few more seconds. There's a generator, which is pretty cool. Okay. We're chilling. Ha, ah, yeah, baby. Alrighty, we made it. I don't know if this is exactly where we need to be, but it's pretty cool that we're here. I do hear some zom zoms around here. Just take it easy. I is he right above me or something? I hear someone. Okay, I'm coming upstairs. <laughs> don't be alarmed, buddy. I'm only here to put you down real fast, real calm, real cool. Oh, I don't like this. A lot of crates here, brother. Is he down here? He's up more. I am ready to shove at a moment's notice. Okay, I don't know where the hell this guy is, and that scares me. <laughs> a lot of generators here. Okay, maybe he's in, like, one of the cracks, and we actually can't reach him. That's best-case scenario. Cigarettes, scrap metal, a sack? Uh, might be useful. Doesn't weigh too much. I'll yoink it. Propane tank? Absolutely useless. <laughs> that would literally just weigh us down at this point. Tires, barbed wire, charcoal, sex. Wow. Nothing useful. We'll take the ciggies. Oh, that was- that could have been bad. <laughs> okay. Okay. No one out in the back. Ooh, car battery charger. That's gonna be... Yeah, but do we... Ah, we'll take it. We'll take it. The hand axe, though. That's nice. We'll equip that actually right on our belt. That'll be a nice weapon to have. Another hand axe. Ooh, my. A muffler. Yeah, we can't use any of those car parts for the vehicle we have currently. <gasps> How to use generators? Yeah, baby! <laughs> oh, yeah! Okay. This just got so much better. We'll actually be able to start up a damn Jenny. Okay. The zombie, I think, is in the wall. So, let's go yoink a generator, huh? Check out this bad boy. 100% condition. That's what I like to see. We'll take it. Now, we're gonna need to level up electricity now, and we're gonna need to take electrical scraps. So, whenever we see that, we're gonna need to yoink it. Oh, yeah. This was totally worth it. That alone just made this entire trip so much better, dude. Car battery charger. Where is this generator at? Think we can drop it off on a seat. Yeah, we can, but it will fill it up completely, which is okay in my opinion. Damn, that's good. That's real good. Put away our hand axe and crowbar. Try and, you know, free up some space here. There we go. This has already been so useful. So now we just need a reliable form of gas, which is honestly the biggest problem we have currently. Let's see if we can get some extra gas laying around here. There are some vehicles laying around, so. Might be in the clear. Honestly, what I might need to do is have everything rigged up to my crack shack. Oh yeah, all those traps too. Oh, this place is so damn good. There's a lot of generators here. Oh my lord. Let's see if we can jimmy this open. There we go. I, I get scared that there's just going to be a random alarm in here. <laughs> Every damn time. Yeah, the only problem that we have right now is gas. We don't have gas at all. Let's go say hi. Make sure no zombies are coming in. Okay, it seems like the horde actually lost me. Oh, there's two. Okay, only she sees me right now, which is good. There we go. Popped her in the skull. Got any keys on you? Wristwatch. Can't actually level up electricity with that, so let's go attract this lady now. Gotta be cautious about this whole thing. All it takes is one foul step, and I am... Dead in the wall. I'm using the good uh, spear. Yeah, use the crappy one right now. I want to save the chip stone spear that's in mint condition for later. Alrighty. Can we can we take these? No. Hey, we can take this one though. Nice trap crate. We got a snare here. It's like a chicken coop. I think it's a chicken coop type deal. Don't matter. Man, what we need right now is just some damn cab. Nah, yeah, those are good. That's good. We got enough traps to last us forever. All we need is cabbage. That's all we're missing. That that way we can actually trap rabbits. We don't have any way to. Tra 
Oh my, look at these crates, dude. Oh uh, yeah, Mr. Krabs. We really do need uh, proper trapping stuff now. I at least feel, feel for traps. Okay, that'll be it for this place. Go check out this little barn area. There's also, actually, we might get lucky with the, these crops over here. They could have, uh, they could be actually fruit, I mean, seed bearing, which would be very good. We need a farm in order to sustain ourselves any longer. Think of this as like grocery shopping, you know? Just getting everything you need for your home, your little homestead, so we can head back. <gasps> Potato seeds! Hallelujah! Oh yeah, baby! Now, we're also gonna stay, we might stay here. Tomatoes. Yes, dude! I think we can actually use tomatoes to, uh, trap. Oh, yeah, it's coming together, baby. And that's it for here. Okay, instead of going through the door, technically getting, like, blindsided, I'm gonna head around like a good boy. No zombies. That's what I like to see. Alrighty, let's go check these bad boys out. I, I have very... Oh, yeah, we can. Seed-bearing tomatoes. Oh, yeah, dude. We're gonna be living good as soon as we get five fresh tomatoes. Alrighty, let's fill up our bag with these bad boys. Hell yeah, dude. Hell yeah. These are gonna be so great for trapping. We also got some cabbages. Oh my. This is good. <laughs> these are these are seed bearing too, aren't they? Seed bearing cabbages. God, how do I get so lucky, man? Four fresh cabbages. Each of those, that's like five uses from the bait right there. Yeah, so... As soon as we get home, we're gonna need to rig up a damn generator. And what I'm gonna do... Hey, we leveled up farming. Very nice. Oh, this is so good. I might eat some cabbage right now, to be honest. <laughs> it's free real estate, buddy. That's 25 hunger. Oh, the cabbage gods have really, really, really came in clutch today. Okay, we're not gonna be too greedy in our pursuits. I'm only gonna take the seeding stuff right now. Oh, God, this is so good. We might have to come back here for seconds, to be honest. 14 freaking cabbages. Can you believe it? Honestly, the cabbages are a lot better in terms of cost than the tomatoes. I might drop the tomatoes then. We got some seeds for them already. Uh, you know, a variety is a spice of life. That's what they like. That's what I like to say. Okay, we got one more seed bearing. Got a few more seed bearing cabbages. Yeah, we're gonna fill up an entire seat. Or, like, the entire back trunk with this bad. <laughs> hey, we got... Does this got, uh, gas in it? We actually don't know. We gotta go grab that. Okay. We'll grab these last two, because they're, like, right here. And we'll go fill up our seats. This is actually setting... Like, we could live sustainably out in the woods forever now. Like, all we need is some damn carpentry skills so we can get a darn roof on, down. And we'll be golden, pony boy. Nothing need to worry, it'll be easy street from here on out, it already is easy street! Aw, oh, there's another stick trap. I will take that stick trap. Stick traps are super useful. Take that bad boy. Take all of them, dude. <laughs> We're gonna be able to trap so much. Aw, oh, if only we knew how to actually make them. That... Okay, that zombie in the, in the back has really got me scared. Okay, we're just gonna go transfer all in one of these back seats. Yeah, there we go. Just drop it all in, and then we'll grab what we need right now. Is that it? Oh man, we really don't have a lot of space for this, huh? Oh, you can drop a few of the cage traps in there. Okay, that's looking pretty good. We have so much to do, man. I will keep the seeds on me, though. Those, <laughs> those bad boys stay, alright? Got nine cabbages, put them in the trunk. Big trout, we'll eat that right now because probably isn't going to get any better. Fresh cooked, delish, easy, breezy. Oh, delicious. And always nutritious as you know it. See how our weight's doing? Weight's going up, baby! Yeah! Just like my self-esteem and confidence. And then it's gonna come crashing down as soon as someone comes up behind me, kills me instantly, and I scream and smash the desk 12 times. Damn, this doesn't have gas. Okay. Well, you only went win a few, and honestly, what's gonna keep us back is, a uh, lack of, uh, lack of gas. 
You know, we don't have a lot of ways to carry gas, and we don't have a lot of ways to continually fuel it. But hey, that's fine by me. We got a well here. Honestly, this would be a pretty good spot to base up. This would be actually a great spot to base up. Well, it seems like that's it for the most part here. I'm guessing this is just like the little uh, outer area for the... Uh, hey, there's something else over there. We might. This might actually be the castle. Hmm. Hey, another gas can. I like to see that. I like to see that quite a bit, actually. The more of that we get, the merrier things will be. Any more gas? No. Okay, I'm not gonna... Oh, my! Hey, hey, hey! What's going on over here? Is that a barbecue? Whoo! No zombies here as well. This feels like the darkness before the storm. <laughs> I don't know for exact. I mean, I'm gonna go check these damn garages. It'd be crazy if you didn't, man. Nails, Bobby, an actual hammer. Epic. I'll take that. Uh, performance break. Yeah. I'm hearing a lot more zombies up north, so we better be prepared for a fight. Is all I'm saying. It might hit the fan very soon. Honestly, I might just head back to barn place and just disassemble stuff to my heart's content. Gosh, dude, level 6 carpentry is gonna kill me. That's the problem that we're having currently. Literature. We don't got enough of that, you know? It'd be a hell of a lot of a different story if we did have literature on our side, but we don't. Oh, wow. No, the castle has to be here, dude. There's no way it isn't. <laughs> Everything points to the ca- Ooh, shoddy shells. <laughs> Shotgun. What is that? All I know are spears at this point, baby. Okay, I'm definitely hearing someone close. Stay frosty, boys. I could hit the fan at any minute, and I... I don't plan on dying right now. Hey, man. Or lady. Yo, is that a leather jacket? I need that. Oh! Absolutely skewered. Yeah, give me that right now. Oh, yoink that in the bag. Into the bloody bag. Anything else we got in here? Another hammer. I mean, this is a lot better than using stone stuff, so I will be taking it. That's basically free, you know, free takings. Ooh, we might also need a door. Well, like, we can jog pretty confidently here, I'd say. We do have the big house right over there, kind of like the... I feel like we've seen those homes before. Oh, God, this place goes on forever, huh? Come with me, and you'll see a world of pure imagination. Okay, there's a construction dude down over there we should be a little bit cautious of. Metalwork at magazines? Yo, wrench. We do need that for mechanic stuff, so I will be yoinking that. Barbed wire, ciggies, welding rods. Yeah, nothing else. It's crazy. Be great if y'all give me like a wilderness mag, so. Okay, that guy sees me. It's just him. Hey, buddy. Got yourself a real nice gut over here. Kind of jealous, not gonna lie. Hard hat. <laughs> Listen, by the time I die, I won't need it. Propane torch, I will yoink, though. God, there's so much stuff here. And there's so little zombies. I thought it'd be like. I thought it'd be like the bridge. But the. The bridge was nice. I mean, the bit the bridge was hell compared to this place, dude. This is paradise. Oh my god, we are reaching it. Do we move? Theoretically, if I wanted to say move, right now. Humna, 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 humna. But like, I'd be leaving behind my my roots, my wilderness roots. But look at this. My god. <laughs> it's beautiful. Holy hell, we're living in paradise. We're the we're the new king of the castle, baby. King of the castle. King of the castle. Yo. I hear a lot of zombies. What's going on here? I'm going to back up a little bit. I don't want them falling on me. There's a lot of zombies in there. There's actually like a crap ton of zombies in there. Oh, look at that place. I wonder if we get a vehicle. 
Okay, one of them got through. I still don't see anyone. Two windows are through. We might have to dip. Come on. Yeah, I see him right there. Ooh, they broke something. Hey. Okay, one of them seen me. Good, good, good. No, no, they did not. I want to loot this damn place. This is where... I'm gonna... Hold up. Give me like 10 second, guys. 10 second is all I ask, and I will be right back with my vehicle to run you guys over. <laughs> this is worth it. This is worth it. I, I will die on this... Uh, I will die on this field. We literally have everything we'd ever need in our entire lives. We are the king of this castle. And uh, I won't let that change otherwise until uh, I get bored of this place and I go back home to, bu to build and, you know, be a frontiersman and all that jazz. I also got some normal homes down over there. Okay, so here's what we're going to do. We're going to get the vehicle, you know, kind of beep, 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 and then see what's going on after. Hey, lady. Okay, one's coming up on me, so let's take her out real quick. There we go. Boop. Boop. Spears are so damn good in this. Oh, there's another. Okay, make sure no one's coming up around me. Always got to be cautious of that. Good night. Two wax is all it takes? Alrighty. At least we don't have to worry about, you know, zombies getting all cut up in there now. God, we can even go fishing here. This place has everything. It has homes. It has abundance of real estate. It has very fancy looking architecture. It has traps. It has cabbage. It has a full, fully, you know, fully stocked farm. One cool thing, though, would be, uh... Farms like still continuing even after disuse so like years after a farm field would still have well very little a small amount of cabbages and stuff You know like why it slowly starts to become more wild less harvests over time I feel like that'd be pretty cool. So you could set up some farms and all that jazz. I don't know. I think it'd be a nice touch, you know anyways <laughs> What is going on Y'all want to come outside? Come on! It's free! It is free! Hey, man. Boink, boink. Wow, this guy's pretty tough, huh? Guess we gotta hit him with the tires. Yeah, 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 come on! There we go! See, this is how life was meant to be. Just kinda cripple them, run them over slowly. Kinda like a very, very, very nice... Massage. Okay. We're gonna go park our car just a little bit outside here. Because I, I definitely know there's more zombies than that. <laughs> Be crazy if you didn't think that. But I want this accessible. Okay. Just gum it down there. Yeah, I, I hear a lot more. Okay. First sight of danger, we, want, we run. I hear danger. I'm running. <laughs> how am I going to do this? Strategically, how do I do this? I want to raid this place. But I'm a bit of a baby. And you would see exactly why. And we're going to use the fences here. Okay. It's actually working pretty- I like this fence. I like this fencing here. No, don't, 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 don't! Oh my good! Take him out! There's one. Okay. Where's this bitch? Right here. There we go. Okay. Okay, that could have went bad. But I, I like this spot. I, I like this fencing here with the hedge inside. I think that's a very smart way to entrap zombies. Let's just shout. Hey, yo, the pizza here! Okay, I only hear one. Just, like, shot a couple more times. Hey! Your mother says smells like a sandwich. There we go. That should really... Well, we could actually go fishing here. Ah, oh, zero fish abundance, so... Gosh diggity dang it. Hello? I only hear one. Let's just hug the window frame. Okay, just dick or easy, boys. 
No need to rush it. <laughs> okay, this room, clear. Let's go check it out. Nothing. Barbell! Ooh, that is right down Chad's alley. God, this place even has a damn furnace, dude. I, I am internally just, just stressing the hell out right now. Okay. At least we can make sure the first floor is clear. Got some literature. Engineer magazine. Hey, that's pretty good. Okay, there's a basement. Let's go check the basement. Okay. There's definitely someone down here. There's some sandbags, though, that we could use for supports. Okay. It's obviously a zombie down over there. Okay, no one else is around. Good. Is it just you? Cool beans. Okay, take him out. Awesome. That's that. Make sure that this is actually it. God, this place is so cool. All right. That's that for the basement. Let's continue. I want to clear this place out right now. Woo, man. This is... Knees weak, arms are heavy. There's vomit on my police vest already. Chad's... Roast Getty. <laughs> I don't know. I don't see anyone up here. Good sign. Big library. Lots of knowledge. Lots of books. I like that. I like knowledge. I like books. Is there some kind of like secret... Like door in here? Is this some kind of like Resident Evil castle mansion type deal? I definitely hear someone there. Just, I'm minding my own business, so I hope you mind yours as well. None of those are being hit. There's one here. I think she might be the last one. Door flash, shove. Okay, she is. Boink. Nice! Wine cabinet. That's what I like to see, man. Yeah, Chadster can dig this. Okay, we'll give it one last shout. It's clear. Four stories of just pure awesomeness. <laughs> oh, man, I can't wait to sort through this. Anyways, I'm kind of curious about the basement. It's fishing for beginners. That'll be pretty useful. I mean, if even if we don't stay here, this is going to be a huge resource for us, you know? So I'm very excited about that. I want to check the basement, though, before I do anything else. Rowel, saws, two generators, washing machine, there's so much. What is in here? This is what interests me. Shotgun shells. Oh yeah, baby! <laughs> we got the goddamn armory in here! I actually hear some zombies still lingering. Let's see, we got a Glock 21. 45 auto mag. I AKMS, H and K MP5 SD. Yeah, we got Breeders! 556 mag- we don't have any magazines though, that's a bit of a problem. Hunting knife. Federal 37mm riot gun. Epic. 45 auto. Winchester model 1897. 50, 100 rounds of 50 BMG. AKMS, Colt. Oh yeah, dude. Oh yeah. 45 auto stick mag, M9 pistol, got a lot of 45, suppressor for rifles, okay, 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 Caltex sub 2000, five, five, hey, we got a 5.56 mag, epic, 308 stick mag as well, okay, what can we actually use, M9 carbine, M1 carbine, might actually be pretty good, I don't know if we could attach the rifle silencer to this bad boy though, that might be a bit of a problem, let's see here, Holy hell. I, I kind of forgot that I had Brita's. So, okay, we can use a Mosin. Oh, we can only attach it with a Mosin, dude? Oh, I get, no, it's not science. It's a suppressor. There we go. So we can use a lever action. Wait, we, we have the Marlin, right? Oh, we totally do. Okay. Let's see what we can actually use it for. 45, 555. Five, five. 223, we could turn that into 555. We got a Glock. Okay, Glocks are pretty cool. AKMS. Okay, we can attach a silencer to that. 
XM carbine. We can also attach one. We don't have a mag for it yet, though. I think we can... No, we need a 30-round stick. So, honestly, the only thing that we might have... We, we actually can't use a lot of these. Damn. Seems like we actually can attach it. It's a different Winchester model. It makes sense, because that's a shotgun caliber. Ah, oh, damn. Do I even have something to use this with? Surely I do. Come on. Okay. See, we don't got any... No, surely we could use these bad boys, right? Let's see. Ah, oh, we probably need to load it up with ammo. That would make some sense. <laughs> Please don't tell me we got screwed over, though. Oh, man, if I had a 45, that'd be great. But I don't. We could use a Keltec, actually. But we can't use a silencer for it. Hmm. So many questions. Not enough answers. Okay, well, we can at least open up this canister. There we go. We can open up one box. Convert it to 556. Five, cool beans. Load it up. We can! Oh my... <laughs> oh, God bless guns, brother, even though this is technically France. God bless the King's Arsenal, huh? Got a silencer on this bad boy. Oh, yeah. Things just got interesting. <laughs> oh, buddy. We have so many rounds of this, too. That's a crazy part. Man, you know what I'm feeling? I'm feeling like we start to bring back the good old-fashioned days. You know what I'm saying, brother? <laughs> you know? Okay, we got any other 556 five, guns here? I mean, I just like keeping quick tabs. MSR 700. <laughs> Imagine using an MSR. But uh, that's a stick mag. We don't have a lot of stick mags unless it's. We also got this XM 117E2 carbine, which is actually weighing less than this bad boy. We'll go compare the two. We still got lights in here, thankfully. You know, we, we can... I don't know when it's going to go out, but it's probably going to come out very soon. Okay, this is a XM. This is a Colt. Let's see here. Ah, I'm a bigger fan of the XM. I guess a Colt, though, would probably... Hmm, damage, range, what about this bad boy? Damage, range, it's about the same thing, I'd say. Probably weighs a little bit more, though. But that's alright, in my opinion. We'll go get some killer, like, iron sights on this bad boy, and it's gonna be one hell of a journey. We also got the Winchester, which we can load up very soon. Got this rifle laser sight that we can attach. I, I think I might end the episode here. If you guys liked this episode, please like, favorite, share, subscribe for more. I will see you guys in the next episode. Have a damn good day. Peace the fuck out.